Hey guys, welcome back to Not For Nothing Homestead. I'm Ginger. I'm sporting my nine acre family farm shirt today. Yes, I am. I love it. It's awesome. Um, okay, but that's not what today's about. <laughs> so you got a little bit of a different view here. We're out in the front yard. This is what I typically, when I'm talking about mowing on the slant on the bad boy, this is what I'm talking about. So, we got something in the mail to do a review on. This little chainsaw. It's a six inch um, battery operated chainsaw from Ting Mint. And we're gonna open it up. We are gonna try to do some work on this tree right here and clean it up a little bit. And also this one right here. So I've got my weed eater out as well um, so that I can get around the bottom, make it look all nice, hopefully trim it up a little bit if I can reach all of it. But we're going to see how this thing does for us. So it came in this nice package. So I'm going to bring you down. We're going to open it up, see what all comes in it and with it. Hopefully, we got a little bit of a charge on. It has two, two batteries with it. So hopefully one or both have a little bit of a charge with them. So come on down, let's get started taking this apart. Okay, comes in this nice little carrying case. We'll pop it open. Okay, voila, we got some safety goggles. Bar chain oil some safety gloves. Here are both of our batteries. And again, hopefully one of these has a little bit of a charge on it. Here is the charging cord for it. Um, we've got a brush and an extra chain in case Ginger breaks this one and a tool to adjust the chain with. And it has this little guard on the top. So yeah, I'm excited to just like get right into this. So let's pop this battery on. We are gonna see if this battery has a charge. So we do a little push now. For those of you who don't know, um, I have had uh, surgery on this hand. They basically rebuilt this hand. Um, so some things that are grippy are not as easy for me to do with my right hand, unfortunately. That uh, is my dominant hand. Um, but I had some arthritic problems in here. So they took out the whole bone. Took out a tendon from here, uh, cut my finger here, cut it here, and took this tendon and put it in here. So I'm basically, I have a bionic, <laughs> a bionic hand here. So let's see how easy this is for me to do. So you're gonna wanna push this button and then pull this trigger. Well, that was pretty stinking easy for me, okay. So let's see what we can do with this tree over here.
So, I ran out of juice. Both the batteries, I changed them. Um, Cause there was only a little bit left, a little in each of them. So I'm gonna have to charge them up so that I can do that tree. Uh, let's see if I can get it. That tree. Then I'm gonna do this one. And then I'm gonna do the one down behind it. Oof. Okay, getting dive bombed up bugs. Um, so yeah, I love that thing. Oh my goodness, and it is so easy. I have, yeah, you saw where I wasn't wearing my goggles, right? Or my sunglasses, whew. So, was, uh, that was super easy with my hand and the limitations that I have on uh, gripping. Um, but, I mean, man, that did so good. And look how nice it looks there now. And this one looks nice too. They look so much better than they did before. Okay, so I gotta go charge up those batteries because each of them had just a little bit of charge and I have run both of them out and I wanna do all these trees. So, guys, that little saw is a beast, okay? That's just in my opinion. Okay, I know I can work the big steel if Joey starts it. <laughs> I can't do that part. But this, for the jobs that I would want to do out here, like what I just did, um, and Tiffany has been waiting to use it. So, Tiffany, now that I've done the review, you get to use it, girl. I know you're happy about that. I absolutely love this thing um, and recommend it for sure because... As you can see, I got some of the bigger branches with it, and it cut through it like butter, baby, like butter. It did real good. I will say, I had, at one point, the chain jumped off, and I just unscrewed the top, um, re reset the chain, screwed it right back on, went right back at it. Um, it's just like a normal chainsaw, you know? And only there's a lot more bolts and things that you have to undo which i'm not speaking from experience i'm speaking from watching joe fix it for you do this but there's a whole lot more that you have to do to get a large gas powered chainsaw back in action once the the chain jumps this super easy i had no problems whatsoever as a matter of fact i didn't even look at the instructions there you go that's how easy it was Okay, so I have a code for you. 50% off. 5-0. 5-0. 50 50% off. Okay, guys? You have to get it through Amazon. Again, it's Ting Mint is how you pronounce it. I'll put it down here at the bottom. Uh, go through Amazon, and you're going to want to use the code, and I'll put the code maybe up here. But it's 50 off. N F N H S, not for nothing homestead. Okay, so if you want one, make sure and go get it. Now this code is only good through August eight, eight eight. So if you want one and you want fifty percent off and you want to cut through butter like I did, uh, make sure and go get one. Okay, so that's it for me here today. As I'm getting little nap bugs <laughs> at Not For Nothing Homestead, guys. I want to say, farm on, be strong, but this is not nine acres. But still, it's an awesome shirt. Okay. All right, guys. Take care of you and yours. God bless. And we'll see you in our next video. And hopefully in that one, I won't be sweating so much. And I won't have stuff all over me.